five pillars to realism in a real engine 5. First one, use good models in your scene. In other words, find models that have enough poly count to be realistic. For example, on 3D Sky, CG Trader, Quixel, and the Viz. And don't worry about this poly count. Import these models and convert them to Nanite. And second one, avoid having very dark shadows for sun and sky. To achieve good results, look at how lighting in the world is. If you pay attention, you will notice there are big blue shades in the sunlight shadows. To control it, use your sky light. Number three, use reference. Nothing is more realistic than real world. Then use reference. Try to achieve the same tones, same textures, same variations. Try to copy the real world, okay? Use reference, copy them, and do it over and over and over until it's perfect. You will see how fun it is doing it in real time. Number four, use variations. There are variations on everything on the real world. Let me show you. Variation on specular and reflection, grass, variation, variation, variations, Variation, okay? It's very important. And number five, camera. Use the camera to your advantage. Use photograph concepts. For example, depth of field, exposure. Sometimes you don't need increasing the intensity of light. For example, you can use exposure. Exposure in the camera. Using exposure, you can do as the eyes do. Are you outdoors? Decrease the exposure. Are you indoors? Increase the exposure. Let me show you. Go to the camera, details, lens, exposure, exposure compensation. So try to use these tips and let me know here on comments if these tips help you in your projects and studies. Okay? So see you soon and let's do it. Bye!